Hi, uh, my name is Matej Novak and in this short video we'll present you the unboxing of a uh, new SATO thermal transfer printer uh, CT4LX. Uh, the camera angle here is a bit off but you'll get the point what's in the box. So basically in the box there are some uh, electrical components, a power adapter, power cord and uh, also taps for plastic taps for installing the ribbons. Uh, there is uh, also of course the, the main unit, the printer itself, which is wrapped in the plastic foil. Uh, upon unboxing you just uh, remove it from the plastic foil, remove the protective films from the screen and also from the top of the printer. Uh, and you're ready to plug it to the electrical outlet. So, as I said, here are power adapter, power cord and uh, course for uh, winding the used ribbon and also plastic spindles for mounting the ribbon inside the printer. Uh, as always read the manual before starting using the printer itself. So uh, we installed the printer uh, connected to the host with uh, Ethernet cable and uh, when you power it on the first time you will see the setup wizard where you set the language units, you set the sensor type and the type of paper how the media is inserted into the printer. Uh, when you select uh, all this you will see the short clip, video clip on how to install uh, labels in the printer. Uh, if you want to skip this uh, video you just uh, press the X in the corner of the video and then uh, the right arrow where you go to the end of this setup wizard. Installing the media is pretty much straightforward and easy um, but you can always uh, check the, the video for more instructions. So here we are concluding the setting wizard. It, wo it won't show again if we select the checkbox and now we are loading the media by ourselves. Uh, you have the pictograms in the printer for all the installing procedures for uh, labels, for ribbons, uh, on how to how to insert the tabs in inside inside the printer. Here we set the labels, and now we are inserting the ribbon. Uh, in the pictogram behind, you can see the plastic tabs and how to set the plastic tabs so uh, you can push them inside the ribbon core uh, all the way in. Uh, first I'm inserting the unused ribbon at the back and uh, at the front I'm inserting also the plastic tab and then inserting the already used part of the ribbon inside the printer. Here in the video maybe you cannot see it uh, well because uh, the camera angle is a bit shifted but uh, you can always go to setting menu uh, on the information and you can also then select uh, help where you can access all the videos uh, all the help videos on how to insert labels how to insert ribbon for the first time and also how to replace a ribbon after it's used so, to repeat, settings and information, select help and here you can access all the videos. I'm selecting replace ribbon and you can see a short clip on how it's working. So, all the commands are accessible via touchscreen uh, except for powering the printer off. You press the, the home button for a few seconds and then confirm powering the printer off. So. Thanks for watching and if you have any information please contact us and uh, we'll help you with your SATO devices. Thank you very much. Bye.